Love, light, greetings, gratitude, blessings and blessings. Beautiful soul family, my divinity to yours. Welcome and welcome back. Thank you for your love, light and support, appreciation, participation, your clicks and comments and for our uniting light, committed and dedicated to uplifting people and planet, being part of this magnificent shift in consciousness, divine energy, divine synergy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. 4th of June, 2024. Vibration is nine. The Hermit. Completing everything that is pending, that is in abeyance, to seek within, through the inner caves, the treasures, the divine gifts, the awakening of your true self. I am reading the energy of the unicorns today. Beautiful creatures of light that have become invisible to the human eye that once freely walked, roamed and enjoyed the earth. A gift from heaven, light-hearted and full of light, spreading light, imparting light from higher dimensions. Hunted for what man, his greed and the need to have the horn, knowing and feeling that there's something magical about it, he needed to have it. So these beautiful creatures were hunted for this treasure. But in fact, that horn was a beam of light that manifested physically but had a power beyond the imagination, comprehension of man. And today can only be seen by the ones that believe in them and that they feel they can trust. Through your psychic eyes, your inner eye, a lot of the gifted children that are coming onto the planet, the rainbow children, the diamond children, the star children, and many more that will come from different rays, from different constellations, will come with the gift of seeing the unicorn. In my higher consciousness, my higher self, a part of me that is not manifest on earth, but very much works with me. I must say, is a queen of the elemental sanctuary in the higher dimensions. Overseeing the vastness of many elemental beings fairies, the mermaids, the mermen, the leprechauns, the pegasus, amongst many that are unknown to the planet of earth. The elves, the gnomes, the sprites,
the dragons. To earth are just a myth, a mystic, but in the higher dimensions they exist. And in this lifetime, I bring with me the knowledge and the essence of knowing these beautiful creatures and have always had an affinity for them, intrigued by their mystic and their magic. So here I am, bringing through from the higher dimensions the pure energy of the unicorn. As I bring the messages through the two decks I have in front of me, but know that my expression will exude to you the pure light, the innocence, the gentleness and the kindness, and above all that, the divineness of these beautiful creatures. So open your heart and your mind to receive the wisdom and blessings. Thank you. O oh, unicorn of light, from the higher realms of divinity, creativity, the sanctuaries that are known to my soul, my higher self, I ask you please to bring us your guidance and wisdom, your love, light and blessings to all that is here to receive it, open-heartedly. Thank you. And I see a beautiful unicorn at a water's edge like a pond. There's rainbow energy around it. And lots of love. It's a golden mane. And a sense of peace and calm. It bows to greet. Thank you. May we have, please, two messages. Thank you. Freedom. Being free to be who you are. You are free to be who you are. To take to the skies, to the land, and to any energy between. Compassion, there is delight, but I am taking two. Delighting in the energy of the unicorn. And look at the colours that come. These beautiful lilac -y. And yet the delight was a very warm, honey kind energy colour. Freedom. Live wild and free, choose your freedom, claim your independence and compassion. Be gentle with yourself, forgiveness will set you free and see the light in yourself and others. It is the month to be free, to obtain the mastery of self in your faith, in your belief, in your peace, in your free and freedom, to be loving and kind and compassionate from the changes and the difficulties of the previous month. It is time to calm and relax and work with yourself to raise your vibration and your consciousness in compassion, understanding, and love, to be free to choose, to decide, to fly, to feel the breeze, to take that leap forward and ahead 
and at the same time to find the me and the pampering time to love yourself into a different shade, a different colour. And may we have two from here, please. Thank you. Not an angel. Divinity. There's two. Not a yeti. Strangeness. The golding of the self, the divine self, endless compassion and the love that you will have, you will change into a different shade. Were you not told that? Your light will begin to change and transform until it darkens and becomes your signature your divinity, not just the angel by sight, by view, by perception, but through divinity, through the golden consciousness of divine consciousness and the unicorn will be yours, the gift of freedom of purity, of innocence, the gift of light into your higher self, your soul self. Not a yeti, strangeness, strangeness is to be different, not estranged, but to open your heart to divine creature, divine understanding of what is in your world just a myth. But there is beauty in all divine creatures an owl with a horn of light, a fish with a horn of light. All creatures of the divine have the horn of light. Do you know what that horn is? It is your third eye. Fully open and active to see and beam, to light up your way, to lead you on the way. And that is what these horns of light are. They are beams of higher consciousness, intuition, insight, to give you light, to make it bright, And the children of earth, you that listen, believe in your magic, believe in the unicorns, the divine creatures of creator. When you close your eyes and think of us and bring an illustration or an image and your faith and your heart is in it, it becomes real. You send an energy beam across many levels.
that reach us and pull us in. And we know the vibration. We feel it and we respond. We can come very close, but we ask you to come closer to us. And know that in your hands and heart and mind and thought there is magic. Activate your horn of light and become a human unicorn just like us horses unicorn birds horses pegasus the creator creates infinitely Humans can grow wings and you sure can have a horn of light. Until we meet again very soon. Be free. Be happy. Be kind and be light. Thank you. Beautiful family, I trust that you enjoyed this transmission with the blessings of light and love and kindness and gentleness. From a higher place, Open your heart and fill the space. I love you, I thank you, and I bless you. Till next.